All right, we're back here in the um, whatever room. Let's check this green time rift. I don't know if the time rift disappears uh, when we're done this area. The lab. Ooh, the lab sounds like one we've done. Um, yeah, the lab we have done. Time rift blue. Back to hub. So it's not the lab. Um, I think we did the gallery. I'm not actually sure. It might have been we filled the gallery well before just to get the, the time rift unlocked. And then we didn't actually double check it. So to the gallery, because I mail room we can check last. We get teleported right next to it, right? So another green rift. So we've done the lab for sure. And the gallery. I know I could just look back at my videos to see which ones I've done. Oh, balloons. I don't know that we've done this one then. Oh, yeah, no, this one has been done as well. Back to hub. Meaning it's the mail room, which I didn't expect. Uh, I thought that one for sure we did. The mail room is this slide right here. Once you've gotten the ice hat, which I have a, a cute little almanite for right now. It opens this room, which should have had a time rift in it. Um, I don't know where the time rift is then. Is it not unlocked here? No, we, we have every area unlocked. Um... What? And then we got... Alright then, guys. I guess we're doing Skyline today. Uh, because... Apparently, I don't actually know which... I hate that ladder. That ladder is in a terrible spot. For what it's supposed to be. Because apparently, I don't know where the um, one we've missed on the ship is. But, I mean, I do know that there was one on the ship missed. Now, you know what? I, sh I should definitely look for the one that was missed on the ship. Because, like, if the mail room disappears when it's done, that's interesting. Yeah, see, windmill is done. The Twilight Bell is done. We haven't actually looked on here for a while. Uh, time rifts detected. It's going to tell us about the two over here. And it's also going to say the finale is done. Because we did all of those in one big run. So we've got this one here on top of the cats area. And this one here. And right at the beginning, the purple one. But... I think we should go for the cats one first, which I think they were towards the birdhouse. So we're going to check that way. Like four minutes in and we haven't actually started anything. The, the downside of not actually being 100% sure which one we've missed. All right. Birdhouse, let's retreat you. Because I think that area right down there to the bottom right uh, is our cats that we are looking for. Oh, there is a special item here. Not too, too worried. And we make it. Sweet. Definitely probably not the way you're supposed to head back. Now you're almost at the birdhouse. Thank you. Do. Oh, that didn't work. Did it push you me back or forward? I still have no idea. We'll collect a few more pawns. But yeah, the no bonk badge made that last one a joke, really. So, long story short, I went the complete wrong way. Uh, definitely just go to the windmill to start things off. Uh, and that'll put you over 
at the right ones. You can already see there's the cat face we had before. Um, also, uh, I think my lighting issue is, has extended because I can kind of see that guy perfectly fine now. Um, but I mean, I guess I'm running it much lower specs than it was supposed to be run, uh, unfortunately, on my PC. Ah, and there's the rift right up there. I should stop stopping because these guys catch me every time I do. Oh, and I just fell off a cliff without my hat. This is going to end badly, but it doesn't make us lose the... Um, if we don't die like Mario would forever. Yeah, they're, they're kind of visible with my current setup. Um, that doesn't stop me from being caught by the guild uh, as much as I'd love it to. So we gotta go find some healing. And now, just make it over there. Because one of these guys as our hat, and we killed them both, so we're good there. Um, I think we could have made it up to the timepiece, but uh, I'd rather get my hat back first and not attempt to um, do this entire thing with no time rift. So our first blue time rift is right there, which I should have just touched, but I missed. So back to it quickly. But yeah, uh, don't go to where I went to, which was uh, the birdcage, go to the windmill. The windmill gets you there much quicker. Welcome to Curly Tail Trail. The first of the two blind, the um, first of the two uh, blue rifts, and it doesn't look as bad as some of the ones we've done so far. But I mean, just because it doesn't look bad doesn't mean it is. Oh, of course, bad camera angles strike again. Um, I was going to say, I think we're supposed to be careful because of, well, hat cats. Which I mean, oh, come on. Yeah, the bad angles you're pretty much forced to do these jumps on kind of make it way more difficult. Because like, yep, see, I can't. We die. I think that gives us back our hat, though, because it resets everything in the level. Yep, we've got our hat back. I'm gonna actually want to go to the time stop hat because if I can, that's gonna be a nice way to sneak past a bunch of these guys. Yeah, nope, doesn't even give me any ability to dodge them. I'd say you're stuck in like one spot. We got back our hat. No, not without losing half our health though. Fortunately, the game expects that and pretty much gave them that as a, uh, I guess, a warning, because you're given back basically all your health right there. And, oh, nope. I thought we could just kind of waltz our way up there. I guess we have to wall jump our way up there. Wow, game. That was nice of you. Give me all these guys all at the same time so I didn't really have anywhere I can go. But I guess if we head up here, we're done. So this one does have some annoying gimmicks, but it was a fairly short time rift in general. The other one is going to be easy because it is going to just be the Twilight Bell. Uh, so I'm looking forward to that one. All right, what do we want to roll? This one? No. No. Last one. At least a sci-fi remix. Yeah, sure, why not? So in Subcom Village has a sci-fi remix. I'll listen to that later. Um, wasn't expecting it, honestly. So our next goal is Twilight Bell. And we will finish up by going to... Yep. Oh, very nice. Yeah, Twilight Bell, because for sure that picture was definitely like the entrance to the Twilight Bell area. Which means it really, because there's not much um, 
before going through the Twilight Bell, we should have a good um, well, minimal area to worry about. Yeah, see? There. It's right behind us. Right where we spawned, right behind us. So, boop. And we're at the second time round. This is why I spent, like, I went and I was worrying so much about the first one. I knew where this one was. It was right next to where you spawned for the Twilight Bell. The picture was very helpful. Like how um, the, the Pink Rift is going to be right by where you spawn for um, the Free Roam. So we have that. This guy, this one we have to worry about, these guys who are going to try to knock us off if they uh, get a chance. We're also going to want to use our Dweller's Mask, though it does give us these guys and not too much to worry about. Especially with our, uh, what is it, the Mad Hatter one, giving us uh, a lot of time to do these ones. So we're going to jump around the big guys. Uh, still have to worry though because uh, if they hit us we're going to, well, fall. They're still basically giants. Oh, not quite enough for that jump to make it. I was gonna. Yeah, I wanted to fall through there because otherwise it would respawn me at the first lamp. Oh, this no bonk badge is definitely worth it. All right, so we're gonna want to jump. Oh, we landed on the first one. So yeah, these guys just kind of slap us away. All right. Let's try it again. Me hitting shift repeatedly didn't help me there. Um, a little worried about that. Because I was trying to hit shift to turn off the power. Like that. No. I have no bonk. I don't know what else I can be doing to make this more. Am I not supposed to be trying to jump that? Am I supposed to try and be going over it? I know I'm, I'm struggling a bit on this one, but I mean, I think the end is literally right past this block. So. I don't know if there's just a part of it I'm not seeing, because this seems too tall for me to make. Uh, there's not really a reason to jump through it, so. Shift, control, shift. I just, I can't turn it off. Do I have to jump through it, turn that off, and then dive? It's looking like it. Uh, that is an annoying jump on this keyboard. I should, really should... Well, rip. One more. One more set of health. Uh, but I, I think I figured it out at this point. I hope I figured it out at this point. Because, yeah, I can see the um, time rift sparkles on the other side. Yeah, you... It's gotta be it, but it feels like that shouldn't be it. That's, that's where I'm getting confused. Let's take off the Mad Hatter. Uh, no, you know, I want the no bat, the uh, no bomb badge or whatever. Yeah, this feels like the right way to do it, and I don't see how we can go around this block. It's too wide to the left and right, so we gotta go through. Shift did not help me there, but it's it's definitely how I'm supposed to be doing this. I'm very confused. 
Oh, thank you, game. Loading me in already flying off the cliff. It's like, oh, I'll have it so I, when I... I swear, I wish I could rebind some keys because I'm trying to hit shift and I might just be hitting control again. T to swap hats. Um, why would I? Is that the is that the strategy here? Oh no! See, it was just jump past that wall. That was the entire puzzle there. That's how big my shift button is, right here. Yeah, it was a little annoying, uh, but we're done this one. So next next uh, puzzle, we're going to take a new color. Uh, yeah, let's equip it. It's going to change us a lot. I don't know if it's going to mess with the hat. I like the, um, uh, the brewing potion. It looks just like Vivian's hat from Paper Mario, so I love it. Um, but that is the blue time rifts down. Ah, that looks actually pretty cool. Uh, changing brewing hat? It does not change brewing hat. I like it. So in the next part, we'll take care of this pink time rift, and that should be about it. See you guys then.